What's going on guys? It's your boy Scrub here back again with another video. Hope you guys are having a great day. I know I am and today we're going to be talking about the dudes that just got arrested for having 17 pounds of illegal whale vomit in their possession. I'm not too sure what they were up to either but that's what we're going to be talking about. Let's go. Nice rack in her ass Brazilian just turned 21 but my bank's a million swear. All right guys at this point you guys know that this channel is dedicated to bizarre news so as soon as I saw that somebody had been arrested for having pounds pounds and pounds of illegal whale vomit, I became immediately interested, dude. This just might be the grossest thing you've ever wanted to smuggle. Like, imagine what the luggage they used to transport this thing had to have smelt like after having 17 pounds of whale vomit in it. Not very pleasant. In a sting operation, police seized 17 pounds of illegal sperm whale vomit. I love that they had a sting operation for this, dude. Like, somewhere out there, you know, illegal sperm whale vomit is apparently such a common problem that, like, the police department has to set up sting operations in order to keep it under control. Oh, how do you make your money? All right, don't tell the cops and keep it on the down low. I sell whale vomit, mass quantities of it. If you ever want to buy pounds and pounds of whale vomit, you just let me know. It's my specialty. Obviously, whales are large, but like, you know, how many whales do you have to track down to have a big enough backlog of whale vomit to turn it into a business? Are you just the luckiest dude in the world? Like, everywhere you go on the high seas, you just happen to bump into some whale vomit? I know people hunt whales, it just seems like this would be so much work to hunt down like a multiple thousand pound animal for like a couple pounds of vomit and then you still have to like crawl inside of its stomach and get the vomit. In a sting operation, police seized 17 pounds of sperm whale vomit. According to several sources, Indian officials recovered it, often known as Ambergis, in a sting operation on Saturday night. Ah oh man, what a great use of a Saturday night. You get the boys together, get around a fire, get a couple brewskis in you, and then you attempt to fence your illegally sourced whale vomit to the nearest person for millions of dollars. I don't know about you, but that's my idea of a perfect night. I <sighs> can't wait to live by the countryside flipping whale vomit like, you know, people on HGTV flip houses. Obviously, I know it's a thing if it has its own name, dude. I just don't really know why people are so down to just be eating vomit, you know? I, I guess, like, maybe it's just a me thing, but I just don't really know how appetizing I could find whale vomit, even if they told me it's really, really good whale vomit. I'm just still not really down. I, I still don't want it. Like, even if you promise me it's really good whale vomit, it doesn't matter how good the vomit is. I don't want it. And what's wild is this stuff was crazy valuable. Like, I was expecting this to be one of those super niche things, but like, yo, these guys literally got caught with a million pounds of whale vomit. Or like a million dollars worth of whale vomit, not a million pounds. That would be scary. Ambergris is a waxy material found in the intestines of sperm whales, and it is said to be utilized in the production of high-end perfumes. Yummy. When sperm whales have a stomach or throat irritant, they wrap it with a greasy substance and cast it out, according to the National... Uh, geographic, that guy's name, a district forester officer in India told the Hindu, the mass float, float or the mass floats a foot below the sea's surface when the animal vomits and can only be collected by people who are aware of it. Apparently, they laid the trap on Saturday after getting information that a gang was attempting to sell the drugs to global markets. According to the Times of India, officials approached the two guys suspected of having this and offered to buy it from them. Yeah, I'm gonna assume the market might not be incredibly hot for whale vomit, you know? Like, out of all the odds, you guys start telling everybody that you have this illegal whale vomit. All of a sudden, two dudes that look exactly like cops show up and offer you a million dollars for it, and not once are you like, mm, you guys might be cops. Clearly, the gang is good at getting whale vomit. I don't know exactly how you get really good at tracking down whale vomit, especially because that sounds so complicated. Like, it floats a foot beneath the surface, so you have to know where a sperm whale is, and then you have to have something irritating its throat then you have to follow it until it pukes and then get it a foot beneath the surface into your boat like how often does that really happen what if these dudes really were just insanely lucky like they just happened to come across it they had no clue it was illegal like this is just one big misunderstanding because I'm just saying the logistics of somebody becoming like a whale vomit farmer just seems ridiculous dude nobody's gonna be able to follow whales all the time and get their vomit I guess theoretically if you killed them you could get it all at one time but then like you just have the rest of the whale like it, wouldn't you also have a bunch of illegal whale businesses then I don't know I just don't really understand the business of whale vomit I guess you know for <laughs> sorry for uh, trying to understand the economics over here 
After offering to sell 17 pounds to the undercover officers, the men fell for the trap and were detained. These two men are currently being held in Nanilam Prison, according to the Times of India. The whale puke is estimated to be worth $1 million, according to Vice. And because the sperm whale is endangered, it's unlawful to utilize it in the United States. Yet it's widely used in other countries, and in India, the drug is also illegal. Wait, it's a drug? I thought this was just like some fancy thing that people use to make perfumes or like just some weird stuff that rich people like to eat for some reason, you know, where they're like, mm, it's endangered, which means I like to eat it more. Like, you know, those rich people that just love to just do that type of stuff. I didn't realize that people were like snorting whale vomit, dude. I think, what in the world is going on, man? I didn't realize that that was even possible. What is in whale vomit? What is that like? Oh my gosh, dude, did you see that Dan burned his house down again, crashed his car, got out, stood on the top, scream, I am Superman, fought off 87 cops and flew into the sky by spinning really fast with his arms out like helicopter blades? I'm telling you, that whale vomit is one hell of a drug. Like, my goodness, do you have any idea how weird it would have to be to just be like, hey man, eat this whale vomit, it'll just make you feel incredible widely used in other countries so this is really common like i i'm surprised i have never heard of this before ever because i feel like this is just one of those weird facts that people would just say when they're doing like the weird fact thing uh did you know that whale vomit actually makes you see <laughs> makes you see winnie the pooh ride from disneyland in real life the Indian Express said that persons seeking to benefit from the material have been known to illegally target sperm whales in ordering to require it from the stomach. The senior manager of the Humane Society's International Animal Crisis, Re Animal Crisis Response told Vice that he and other conservationists are concerned that more individuals will start hunting sperm whales for the chemical rather than simply collecting it when it arises. While there was a period where people would find it floating around in the ocean, it might lead to people murdering sperm whales in big numbers and checking for it simply because the chances of finding it otherwise are so remote. Yeah, I definitely think that would start happening, especially if the contents are worth like 1 million for 17 pounds. I'm assuming a whale has quite a bit of uh, vomit in its stomach. And we also know that like when people find out something's valuable, they overdo it. What's that one place where they like club all the seals or all the dolphins that people kill all the time? Sharks for shark fin soup. Once people find out something gets valuable, there's always some person out there that's willing to like basically hunt it to extinction. So uh, yeah, I could understand why they're trying to crack down on this. I just feel like that's definitely something that would start to happen. People just slaughtering sperm whales, looking for vomit, leaving the bodies to rot because it didn't have the vomit. Like, humans can suck, for sure. And I don't think we're all like that, but everybody knows that somewhere out there's a Disney villain just waiting for his chance to start hunting whales for to, like, there's no abandon. So be on the lookout, dude. If anyone ever off you you some whale vomit, now you know it's illegal. You definitely don't want to be there because the cops are coming. The FBI will arrest you. And uh, overall, I just didn't even know any of this was a thing, so I figured I'd share it with y'all if you guys could find it interesting. But that's going to do it, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. Press the like button. If you did, comment down below all that good stuff. If you really, really want to help me out, you can check out the intro song linked down below along with the link to my podcast, The Scuffed Cast, or you could use code SCRUBBY at the G Fuel checkout. Great way to get a discount. And it's October, which means the Halloween merch is still on sale. It's on your screen now, and you can find it at the top link in the description. Be sure to get it. But, uh, yeah, on that note, guys, don't get anyone pregnant. If you do, make sure they're hot, and hopefully I'll see you guys next time. Sorry about the dog. I'm out. Peace.